I want to speak about my username and purpose. Seeing as I was asked. Truth-seeking processes allow people in society like myself to examine and come to grips with past crimes and atrocities. By the wolf in sheep's clothing order of magnitude and his sheep followers to eventually prevent their future repetition. Such things take time stages as such. I would say this is a seven-stage process. Truth-seeking often occurs in societies emerging from a period of prolonged conflict or authoritarian rule which we have all endured recently. The manner in which things were dealt with recently by magnitude is indefensible, especially when he continues on the road he is on. Through a truth-seeking process, I am able to investigate past abuses by magnitude and seek redress for his victims and their families. You see the problem here lies in the fact that he placed so many respectable people in the paranormal field in the firing line with his conduct. How you react to things in life does not just reflect on one. It can be many. He failed to understand the harm he was doing to respectable people's names in the field of the paranormal community. Such investigations that I am doing go beyond simply identifying guilty parties or individuals like those in Magnitude's group. I plan to investigate root causes, patterns of suffering, and social impact on the paranormal field, as well as events in individual cases. By seeking to investigate such questions, with a high degree of professionalism and commitment, truth-seeking processes seek to create long-lasting public impact, often through the publication of a public report. Such reporting helps expose the facts of violations and suffering, which are often otherwise denied and minimize possibilities of revisionism in the future. We all have the right to seek the truth even in the eyes of the liars. Many steps taken in a truth-seeking process are based on the premise of a right to truth. All I see are lies and cover-ups with hate speech. By this community he represents and leads. Changing the name of his community group shall not change my focus. You cannot escape the truth about you Riley and the sheep you heard. The right to truth entails that victims and communities affected by past crimes have the right to know the identity of perpetrators. To speak truth, we must seek truth. Truth-seeking requires persistence and humility. When we seek truth in any form, we are seeking to understand some small aspect of the reality of the negative aspects that have flowed from the name order of magnitude and his sheep. Truth-seeking will sometimes takes us outside our comfort zone, obliging us to admit things we would rather deny, or calling us to difficult action. So this is not done with a heavy heart it must be said. Wisdom is to know the truth by any means, and share it in an appropriate format with everybody, for the guidance and benefit of all. Now we see clear about this group that order of magnitude heads. They are all coming out attacking people who have walked away. Nobody even mentioned proving demons. And yet he gets accused straight away of being me. Riley sending his scatty head sheep in to cause negativity. This is the truth shown from my first upload. I have proven what these people are like. But the truth seeking shall continue. Until this wolf in sheep's clothing is brought to truth. Those who walk in darkness shall never find the light.